Lieutenant, I'm a little busy planning our next mission. Come of course, Captain. Listen, before you... I... Of course. Hi. Lieutenant, how can... Zack, good to see you. How does... Pretty good, thanks. How are you? When's your next deployment? I do not know, but what I do know is this. They're going to be sending me to the front lines alongside all the others. That I'm certain. I want to make sure that none of us become close. No matter. You're not here to listen to my belly aches. What can you tell me about Alan? You shouldn't care about that little prick, Zachariah. That more... Do you know my captain? I've had the opportunity to run into her a couple of times. Only our own can be straightforward with her. What do you know about Colonel... Do you know how dangerous this question... Every... Goodbye, Sean. Goodbye, Zach. Zachariah, a pleasure. I finally managed to meet the merchants you told me about. It wasn't easy. The mob kidnapped them for serum. I freed them before talking to them. I'm sure gratitude helped to loosen their lips. So what knowledge was gleaned? Word that Aurora is running large-scale excavations along the shadow paths near our territory, and in the process, uncovering important objects, maybe even a relic. Fascinating. Finds that are no doubt better off in our hands than those of Aurora's technomancers. Keep those merchants close, Zachary. Information like that is such. You are no more free to roam than the rest. It may seem petty. It. How are you, Zachariah? I'm fine. Good. How may I be of service? Lieutenant Zachariah Manser. What a pleasure. Um, hello, sir. I don't think I've had the honor of meeting you before. Ah, of course. I am Colonel Victor Walter of the ASC. Colonel. At ease, Lieutenant. At ease. 
simply came to congratulate you and learned that you become a technomancer of the highest degree. For a young man from the rogue family, that's a terrific achievement. Thank you. No, no, thank you. Your road must have been difficult, but you persevered. An outsider who managed to work his way into the ranks of the elite technomancers. A marvelous story, especially given their secrecy. They've always fascinated me. Do you have any insight as to why they chose to be so insular? I'm sorry, Colonel, but I don't know what you mean. What a shame. By coming to you out of friendship and camaraderie, I was hoping that you wouldn't treat me like an outsider, too. All right, then. Back to your duties. But think about what I ask, and we'll see each other again. Excuse me, soldier. I want to... Freeze! Not another step! You leave me no choice. Weapons hide! And kill this guy!
let's chat. You wanna chat? Sure, why not? Not like we're at war here. Let's just have a goddamn tea party. Whatever you wanna chat about. Oh shit, I'm sorry, Lieutenant. I didn't see your stripes. Your uniform threw me off, sir. My mistake. It's fine, Corporal. Stand down. Listen, Corporal, you're confused. You're scared, and I get that. Not a lot is making sense to you now, but you have to trust me. You're back in Ophir, and your wife, Maya, she's worried about you. Maya? How the hell do you know my wife's name? Did you do something to... Your wife's fine, Corporal. She even told me about that ribbon you sent her. She told you about the ribbon? I, I don't... I don't understand. There was a goddamn war raging out there. I heard it. We were under siege. If we're in Ophir, you're telling me it's under siege? It was. The fighting's done, though. You held the warehouse like men. So just relax and return to your barracks. Rest. Wait for your wife. She has some good news for you. Good news? Of what? The best kind, trust me. The kind that'll be a reason to stay safe. Stay alive. Yes, sir. Thank you, sir. Men, listen up. Lower your arms. We're heading back to the barracks. On the double. Unfortunately, this is beyond my skill level. Doors locked from the other side. Guess we're going around.
Hi. Lieutenant, how can I help you? I solved your problem, Quartermaster. Is that so? And how'd it go? I'm afraid there are deaths to report. Shadows? What happened? They didn't even have a chance. They were so under the influence of the drugs. I'm sorry, but there was nothing more we could do. Holy shit! I've always been against this kind of experimental injection. A good soldier doesn't need this bullshit. I would have preferred to be wrong for once. I managed to get a sample from a friend overseeing the test so that I could have an antidote made. Other soldiers are probably getting injections. We'll need to get them treated. I can make you an antidote. I know someone who should be able to do that pretty quickly. If he's able to do it, he will save a lot of lives. Here. I really hope there won't be any more dead. Already back, Lieutenant Zachariah? Despite the attack, the officials reached the source. Good work, Lieutenant. Captain, they caught us off guard. Did what we could, but we took some casualties. Fucking Aurora. The High Judge? It was close, but we got him through alive, Captain. Silver lining in all of this. His loss would have been a blow for Ophir. Go see the Quartermaster and get your pay, Lieutenant. Our response to the attack can't be passive. We strike fast, we strike hard, and we strike now. ASC discovered that they got in through the Underworks, through tunnels connected to their shadow paths, so that's where we're gonna hit them. Get a rover and Amelia Reacher to drive you there, and wipe the Aurora shits off the face of Mars and destroy their damn tunnels. Failure's not an option. This is a mission of pride for this army, not just for abundance. They struck us in our home. For that, we'll annihilate them. Don't let us down, Lieutenant. What of Boris, who led the deserters? He was a good soldier. Once. Before being repatriated, the front broke him. Made him battle crazy. War can do that. Make you unfit for life away from it. Understandable, but unacceptable. As hard as it may be for you and your men, we can't let people like Boris endanger the cohesion of this army. What about Jeffrey? Jeff Hunter's a little shot of adrenaline from Greenhope. Good soldier. Young and brash and annoyingly childish at times. But I'd rather have a unit of brave idiots than an army of brilliant cowards. What about Jeffrey? Jeff Hunter's a little shot of adrenaline from Greenhope. Good soldier. Young and brash and annoyingly childish at times. But I'd rather have a unit of brave idiots than an army of brilliant cowards. What's the word on David? David Ward's a good soldier. Great track record. But he's grown bitter for some reason. I don't think he's one to do anything stupid like go AWOL, but I just hope he gets back on track in your unit. A sand out of his eyes. Just...
Hi. Lieutenant, how can I help you? Captain Eliza told me to come find you for my pay. Indeed, I've been expecting you. Here you go. You already back, Lieutenant Zachariah? the effects of the war, even at the market. Vegetables are hard to come by, and I have to wait in line for hours. This is really something, ain't it, Lieutenant? Getting revenge for an attack on Ophir, smack dab in the Aurora Front. Taking a rover, too. Imagine my luck. I've never ridden in one before. Oh, I feel 
terribly grateful for this whole thing. I mean, come on. Not every day you get sent out on a heroic top-level mission with Amelia Reacher. Have you met her before? She's an adventurer. You, a Technomancer, right? Get the hell out of here. You surge around here, you're gonna fuck up my baby for good. Uh, just like you don't spontaneously combust, we don't spontaneously search. Is that you on the poster? Yeah, name's Amelia Reacher. We're discoverers one and all, like father, like daughter. Why? What's it to you? Well, me and my men need to get to a site on one of Aurora's shadow paths. Heard you'd make that happen. Wish they gave me a heads up a Mancer was coming along. But orders are orders. I can take you whenever you're ready. Hello, Amelia. The techno- Zachariah Manser. Yeah. Yeah, I know him. He's one of my father's friends. I still see him every so often. Well, me and my men need to get to a site on one of Aurora's shadow paths. Heard you'd make that- Wish they gave me a heads up a Mancer was coming along. But orders are orders. I can take you whenever you're ready. First rover trip? Yeah, first time this far from Ophir. Nice! How's it feel? Exciting, I guess. A little terrifying to go this far without having the protection of a shadow path, but life's about the adventure, isn't it? Took the words out of my mouth. That's why I love my job so much. Life's too damn short to play it safe. You guys doing okay? Nervous about the fights we're gonna face? The fights? What fights? I did not leave my home and laboratory to foray into battle, child. Did someone tell me this? Because I don't recall being... We needed a doctor with us, Scott. I just... I... yes, I understand. I do. But fighting is... it's a dangerous... people get hurt, and I... I guess that's why... I mean, of course, I will care for you. But no fighting means no wounds to you. Yeah, I, I can't lie. Yeah, it scares me. How big's the fight we're looking at? Aurora's troops and Technomancers. We'll have to be tactical about it. Hit them in small groups, since there's not a lot of us, but... We stick to that plan, and we should be fine. Sure, yeah, I I'm sure once we get there and we get to doing and not just thinking, I I'll be fine. It's the thinking that wreaks havoc on me. This ain't my first rodeo, Lieutenant. Being on a rover is pretty neat and all, but still, no different from past missions. Hit an enemy, get hit back. Find ourselves down deep in shit creek and then wait for backup. In other words, it always goes tits up, but when you've been in the bad long enough, you get used to it. Did you just call my baby pretty neat? That's it? Pretty neat? I mean, I didn't mean it's swell. Real swell. Holy shit. I think you guys plucked this fucker from the farm before he was right. It's huge. It really just shows how big a scale Aurora thinks on. All right, let's focus on finding the tunnel entrance.
Those structures look colonial. Dome's gotta be close. What are you looking for now, Lieutenant? These are strange structures. I've never seen anything like them. Are you looking for something particular? I don't remember. I'm sure the captain will like it. That's just my opinion. <laughs> Technomancer from abundance. And I heard you were all nearly extinct. What are you doing here? What do you want? I want to come in, and you're gonna help me. No, I don't think I am. I told you you would. Don't know why you didn't believe me. Here I come.
dome's in amazing condition. Though I doubt Aurora's been taking care of it. I wonder where the relic the merchants talked about is. Or even how... Well, it looks like we found the relic. Doesn't look like much, but the style of writing looks familiar. Even if I don't have a clue what it means. You able to decipher it? What is it? Is it even real? We haven't been able to decipher it yet, but... Yes, no doubt it's real. Not sure if I can tell you anything else about it. I don't know what you're planning to do with it, and I don't want to offend you by talking about sacred matters, but... You know some knowledge should only stay among technomancers, right? So I know what I'm doing. What is it? It looks so old. We should show this to the captain. It must be important, judging from how well guarded this place is. It's an ancient object indeed, but I don't think that the captain will be interested in it. Oh, this is one of those ancient objects technomancers collect. Fortunately, this is beyond my skill level. 